We're live. Um, hype, hype people, I make a whoopa sound, and then they eat up my pop, um, and then see making stuff, and then whoopa, whoopa part. Yep, we've got it all ready. This is part two, so this remote, you can stand up now, honey, if you want. We'll get back down to show them, but because it looks like it's hard for you, huh? Okay, so what I discovered was, if you'll notice on your power module, when your battery gets low, and I've already changed this one out, but your light will be, and I hope you guys can see this. Yeah, okay. So there's a yellow light here that will come on when your battery's running low. I was sensing that there wasn't enough power to feed. At the same time, um, yeah, we've got, we tried to make sure that we've got enough power coming from the remote by one of the kits that um, I got, Damon has this power module that you can just plug in so you, and it's rechargeable so that you don't have to worry about power being too low for our remote. And the cool thing that we discovered about this, look you guys, it's so awesome. This power box has, whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> we almost lost this. This <laughs> that would have probably been the funnest thing to see. It started rolling off of the table. I don't think you guys could have seen it because, it, but it started going backwards <laughs> off of the table. Okay, so my bad. Let me. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, that cracked me up. Oh, the wheels. Okay, let's <laughs> let's see. No, it's not your fault, hun. It's okay. Let me turn off our power on this one so I can finish showing them. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> That was hilarious. That's true, there's a stop gap. So as soon as you unplugged, as soon as he took this out. Okay, so maybe it was your fault. As mm -hmm. soon as he took the power module off, it it released the, the device. It released the receiver from the, in the middle here, creates sort of a stop gap. Okay, so anyhow, look at these feet. So on your, <laughs> on your brick or your breadboard, you can put it flat if you want to, or you can put in there nice, and long enough to stay, or you can put it up on its side, which is awesome, makes it a little bit neater. And of course, this one, let's just put it this way. Nope, we had it right. This one will of course plug into your slider option for your input, right Andy? Mm. Are you are you gonna dance for us? You, no. <laughs> you look like you're stuck. <laughs> Hey, if you're going to dance for us, okay. No, no, <laughs> or you're not energetic enough tonight to dance. We've done a lot today, right? Okay, the other thing is, um, as I had said before, you want to make sure that both your... <laughs> oh, so you are dancing. <laughs> make sure that both your... Uh, we're going to get through this because we don't want to have to do a third part on this one. Both your transmitter and your receiver are on the same channel. And I had previously tested out all channels. But it looks like someone moved this again, who I'm guessing would be Andy, right, mister? Let's take a look here. I'm going to just check our receiver before we start, and then we're going to show them how this thing rolls, provided there are no more issues. Uh, I'm going to repeat that. Oh, well, you that's why you're dancing? No. Seriously? No, we're going to have to. Uh, we mm. are going to do a part three, because you have to go to the restroom. We can't make you hold it. It's not good for your bladder. Okay, let's stop, and then we'll do a part three. <laughs> or actually, uh, I wish they could have seen it fly off the table, practically fly off the table. That was pretty mm -hmm. cool. See, you make a no, you got to tell them goodbye. We're going to have to do part three. You got to go to the restroom. Uh, That's why the dance. That was the, I've got to go to the bathroom mm -hmm. dance. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Bye. Bye.